The longest war protest in Sacramento took to the streets tonight, as they have every week since that war started 16 years ago. I believe I should be exercising my rights to bring a better world. You may have seen them on 16th and J Streets in downtown Sacramento. That's where we find CBS 13's Jennifer McGraw live to explain exactly what they're fighting for. Jen. It's in one of the businesses here in Sacramento and across from the Memorial Auditorium. Already a tribute to the men and women who died making the ultimate sacrifice. Folks who stand out here with those signs hopes no one else has to make it. These anti war protesters have a passion and a commitment to their cause. We want to stop all wars. Every Tuesday evening, they've held a peace vigil at the corner of 16th and J Streets. I parked the car and joined them. And that was 16 years ago. A protest Gary Meyer says started shortly after the 9 11 attacks. As the buildup to the war in Afghanistan began, we had almost a hundred people out here. I just don't believe in violence. But the president says just pulling out of Afghanistan would make terrorism worse, and the world can't afford that. I will not say when we are going to attack, but attack we will. This week, President Trump announced a new troop surge in the Afghan war, discouraging news for those hoping to bring the soldiers home. One of these days, war has to end because it's not sustainable. The Trump administration says more military resources are needed there to fight terrorism. The vacuum we created by leaving too soon gave safe haven for ISIS to spread, to grow, recruit, and launch attacks. But these activists believe it's time to end America's longest war once and for all. We just need to get the troops out. And until then, they'll be holding strong at 16th and J. And the group tells me they've lost a few members over the years. So if you'd like to join them, it's every Tuesday night out here on the corner. All right, Jen, thanks very much. Live for us tonight in downtown Sacramento.